Hello everyone, welcome to 3designacademy.com. In this lesson, we will learn about the Intersect tool. Like project, Intersect is used uh, in the process of trimming. However, unlike the project tool, um, it is more uh, useful for combining surfaces. Okay, so in order to access Intersect, you have to go to a surface edit and you have to, you'll see under project, you'll see a yellow arrow. So all you have to do is click and hold and beside, uh, next to project, click intersect like this. Okay, well, we need some objects to intersect with. So let's create some right now. So I create a sphere right here and let's also create a cylinder. So I'm just gonna select a cylinder and gonna say uh, press zero and enter and create the cylinder at the origin. Okay, so let's say I'm going to intersect these two objects. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click, okay, let's click the uh, tool first. So it says select surface to intersect. So I'm gonna click the sphere like this. And I'm going to select the cylinder. But notice that the cylinder, there's only one, uh, that the curving surface has been created here, but it's not been created here because the cylinder is actually made up of, made up of two surfaces or more than two surfaces. So I'm also going to click here. Okay, now that the carbon surface is established, I can use the trim tool in order to trim the pieces away. Okay, so I'm just, let me turn, turn the grid off. Okay, I'm gonna say trim, I'm gonna trim here. Notice that we also have a green cross right here. That means everything is touching and the region is closed. So I'm gonna say keep. So now, when you click on the sphere, you'll notice that it's only this part is, uh, the part inside the cylinder is gone, okay? It's been trimmed away, same thing over here. I'm gonna say keep, and also over here, say keep. So now, these two surfaces are combined together. All right, that concludes this lesson. Thank you for watching.